Walter Cunningham from Apollo 7. 500 years from now, there's only going to be one thing that they remember about Apollo, and that's the man landed on the moon. That'll be it. And uh, uh, people have no idea how hard it was, for example, to get the first Apollo mission off. Uh, Apollo 7 was the fifth mission that uh, Wally Shaw, Don Isley, and I were on, and it, finally we flew. Everybody, we, we had like 30 people, Mercury, Gemini, and Apollo programs, and the first three groups that had been selected, and we all were competitive, all trying to get the next mission, whatever it was. And uh, as I mentioned, it took it like thir three attempts to get up to get there in Apollo 7. But I don't think that the people very often today believe me when I tell them that we didn't spend our time. I can assure you this. We did not spend our time focusing on risk. We were, we'd all been fighter pilots. We all knew that there are things that you could do could kill you. But the reason that we became successful fighter pilots, one of the main reasons, is we always felt that we could do whatever we had to do.